What up, everybody? It's Boy Seems Kicks back again with another review. I'm late on this one, but I, hey, you know, it is what it is. I'm a busy man. Um, hope everybody's out there blessed, being out there safe. And uh, before I go on this review, I'd like you to do me a great favor, a really big favor. Do me a favor. Leave a comment below at the end of this review. Smash that like button. And like and subscribe, man. Subscribe. It doesn't hurt. I just, it's for the algorithm. But, okay. A lot of people were not happy with this. I don't know why. All I can just tell you is that if this was a retro that came out, like one of the shoes he actually played in, I'm telling you right now, this would have been sold out. Uh, matter of fact, I think it is sold out, but I'm, I'm not for sure. I did go up to a uh, finish line or JD Sports. And I didn't see them, so I'm hope I'm thinking they're off the shelves. So let's look at the box. Everybody's familiar with this: the red box, Jumpman in black in the middle. You got cement on the bottom. You got the uh, actual size 11.5, one of my size. Um, the Air Jordan 6 Retro. And you got your details right there. You look around the box. This is all red in the back, right there in the back the details of it but who cares about the box who cares nobody cares I don't care so let's open this up there's your lid and I already worn these once that's your little stamp right there nothing else the mint paper right here pull this up a little bit and then you pull back the paper and there you have it. Now, I'm a six guy. I like sixes. Sixes was, man, chef kiss. But this particular six, I'll be real with you. I was going to pass on these. I'm not lying. I was going to pass on them because I didn't think it was all that until I put the shoe on my feet to try it on. And sixes are very comfortable. Um, sixes are the nicest style, I guess. Um, well, as you can see, you can see the two, three, the red. I, I wish he wore these. I really do. I wish he wore these when he was playing with the Bulls. Now, we all know the design that Tinker Hatfield got the idea from was a Porsche. Um, Porsche. Uh, you can see the back. That's the fin right there. The material's red interior. The nice grainy suede right there. The little holes for ventilation. The bubble right there. Um, we also know that majority of them, the, the um, style of the shoe is a combination of, um, you know, I would say the Harachis because it's got that nice little. What is that, the 7? No, I think these do. These have a little bit of the Hirachi style in it also. Um, so let's go with the you know, the front of the toe box. Look at that suede right there. Then you got your tongue, which is made out of that same material like the Hirachis. It's that nice, uh, I think it's neoprene fabric right there. Red laces, that's all you get with them. On the medium side, if you look right here, you got the... Uh, like I say, the two, three. Most people don't see that, but I'm gonna show it to you anyway. Uh, let me just put this down. Let me get the other one out. Let me put this lid down because it's making it harder. Okay. And that's better. Okay, so this is the two, and this is the three. So that was one of the things. The little pods on the side for cushioning for your ankles. The little Porsche design on the back. Uh, the fin. And uh, also, a lot of people who don't know, some people who do know, the reason why there are two holes here, because Michael Jordan asked Tinker Hatfield if he could design a shoe where it was quicker to put on, because some of the shoes in the past were so hard to slip on. So that way he could just jump in and start getting ready. So these are holes for your fingers, so you can grab it and pull it on. And also in the back of the, the hook, because you know you put your foot in first and you want to take the hook and slide it on. 
Yeah, you jump in and read. A lot of people not really. Some people are not happy. I'm not gonna say a lot. I shouldn't take. I'm gonna take that back. Not a lot, but some people don't like this because they rather for it to be black. I'm on the fence. I either or. I'm happy with it. Uh, that nice material on the inside, all black. Uh, jump in red. Uh, red shoelaces. Um, black fabric material around the collar to soften the inside of your shoe. Sixes are very comfortable. Um, the mid part of the shoe, the midsoles, you got your black, you got a combination of, of the red. No bleeding, which I'm surprised because the Cardinal set, the Cardinal Six, um, they were bleeding, and that's why a lot of people weren't too happy about them. I do have those too. You got your um, crystal clear um uh outsoles on the side you can see right here your icy soles right here look at that that's clean on the bottom well you already know you got your jordan jump right there now these were brand new when i bought them i just like i said i just worn them not too long when i call myself clean it so i can grab it and stuff because i don't like touching the bottom of my shoes because uh the stuff you walk in um this part right here the little bib i call it a bib i forgot what to call it I got the jump man right there and a lot of people don't know that this part unsnaps and flips down so that way you can take your laces and thread them through properly um the bottom part does not remove so you have to struggle with this part right here but when you get up to the top part past the jump man's head you can flip this down and uh finish lacing them up um uh, you only get one set of laces that's the red one. I haven't seen one. I haven't seen them in black yet. I wouldn't mind trying that out. Or maybe that cement style might look nice on the box. The cement. Try that out. Um, $200 is the price on this one. And um, like I say, I was going to pass on them. But after seeing them in the store and trying them on, I was like, yeah, um, I'm going to get these. And then let's see here lace tips nothing I wouldn't like I said I wouldn't mind having two uh, two styles of laces would have been nice I know I'm, I'm really crappy with this camera I'm sorry I'm using my phone but um like I say leave a comment below let me know if you guys picked these up because like I said I'm pleased with these and even like right now the camera's making it look real bright, but in front of me they're not that dark. They're not that bright. They're kind of dark, but the camera's making it look more. The red is like real vibrant, vibrant. I'm sorry, so it makes it pops more. But um, yeah, let me know if you pick these up or did you pass? Which plan on picking up? As you see, I didn't. Uh, I've been wanting these ever since I've seen them, and now I'm really, really glad I didn't say I wasn't gonna get them. Cause like I said, you can say you like them when you first see them on, on photos, and then say I pass, but then you might change your mind once you try them on. Cause like I say, these are clean. I mean, these are really clean, and I do have the Raging Bull fives, so now I got the Raging Bull fives and I got the Raging Bull six. No, I have not worn my Raging Bull sit fives yet. I do want to wear them, uh, but I want to wait until like September, October. Um, your lace locks. These will not be up here because Jordan didn't wear them up here. He wore them down here. So if you watch Jordan when I was watching them, you know that these were down here. The fives, I'm trying to think if he ever wore those when he played in the game. I have to go back and look at some videos or some photo shots of him wearing his lace locks on the fives. But you, I'm telling you, man, this is, this is real clean. So, all right, man, I'm going like, to get off of here, put these back up. And uh, I, I got, like I said, I got another pair of shoes I'm going to do a review on. So, y'all stay blessed. Y'all take care. And um, I just do a, did a review. Not a review. I just did a video about reps. I got a corny title saying this is your brain on reps. So, check it out. Uh, I hope you like it. All right. Take care, y'all. Peace out. Oh, and... Uh, Father's Day is coming up. Yeah, I'm just letting let you guys know Father's Day is coming up. Peace.